how to do a hanging indent in Canva. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I am going to show you how you can add or do a hanging indent in Canva. It is very simple and easy to do. All you have to do is to follow up as always the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you will be good to go. Now the first thing that you have to do is to go to canva.com. For those who doesn't know what Canva is, it is a website that allows you to create free designs from uh, these uh, magnificent features that uh, Canva provides you for free. Also, they have some paid plans or pro plans that are very amazing, so you can go ahead and try this. Now, let's go to the point. Here, I'm going to let you see uh, how to do a hanging indent in Canva. Now I'm going to create, for example, or I'm going to select a presentation. Let's go ahead to this presentation. Here, this paragraph text, for example, let's go ahead and put this paragraph text and I'm going to copy and right here, I'm going to put the text multiple times like that. And normally the uh, indent or the uh, hanging indent is the first title or the first phrase of the paragraph you will see that phrase go into the left side and um, it is far away from the other lines like that i'm going to show you how you can create that indent now the first thing that you need to do is to go ahead and copy the first thing or the title of the paragraph that you are going to put for example i'm going to click on copy or I'm going to click on cut simply. Then I'm going to create a text box for it. Or for example, a heading. Let's go ahead and create a heading. Then I'm going simply uh, to put this one. As you can see, this is the heading. And then I am simply going to drag the heading a little bit to the left like that. And here we have everything in order. Here is the um, the square or the uh, frame of the presentation. So this is in the pink. We are not going to uh, go far away from uh, that one. And here we have the uh, indent or the hanging indent added. Now all I have to do is to put the text right here. And here we go. This is a hanging indent. Now, let's go ahead and try this for, for example, a paragraph or a, uh, let's go ahead and for a article, for example, I'm going to delete that. I'm going to chat GPT. Then I'm going to let chat GPT generate for me a, an article. Let's go ahead to chat GPT. It is very simple. Now I'm going simply to stay logged out here, write me like that a uh, small paragraph for example paragraph of f4 or 4 school or i don't know uh, it is not for school but for uh, let's say affiliate affiliate marketing marketing like that and here we go i'm going to wait for uh, the the text it is created i'm going simply to copy and paste that let's go back to the design here i'm going to add a text box i'm going to uh, right here paste the text that we have i'm going to delete chat gpt yes indeed now i'm going to adjust my text right here it is a little bit bigger i'm going to select all of the uh, the text that is in that box I'm going to make it smaller like that. Like this also. I don't have I don't want uh, to mix something like that, but I think that I have a problem with this. So, here here we are good. Now I'm going to select all the text, then I'm going to put the font size for example for 14. Now this is a very small, 24. Uh, this is, I think, acceptable. Let's go ahead and make the paragraph a little bit smaller, like that. 
and now I am going to make the paragraph uh, with another font let's go ahead and choose another font like that maybe no this no it is uh, very ugly it is not suitable for this one but this is it now I'm going to put for example a point to the first sentence I thought marketing is a powerful strategy where business partner with individual or other companies like that to promote our services this is the first phrase I'm going to simply cut this part here I'm going to delete that point now I'm going to put this text right here then I am going simply to add another uh, text box paste the uh, the first heading that we have I'm going to put the same here the same size 24 like that and the first thing that you need to do is to go ahead to this text then you are going to put it like that here I'm going to put like this and then I am going to align it to the left and here we have it this is the uh, hanging indent that we need to uh, provide or to create you can go ahead and make the text bold so uh, the uh, the readers will know that this is a hanging indent and this is it that was very simple and very easy all you have to do is to adjust the text and then you are going to put this slide for another slide and etc now let's go ahead and and select those two paragraphs I'm going to group them so they will work or uh, be moved along together right here I'm going back to chat GPT then I'm going to search for example uh, for more details I need need more details details like that details here it will uh, make uh, everything in order here we have the details some of the details uh, here we have to promote their product commerce where's the commerce it is just uh, made a little bit a stretch it has stretched a little bit the paragraph right here I'm going to back to this uh, Canva click on text add a text box copy here I'm going to put the size for 24 and this is the same one here I am going to select the for example the last part which is this then I'm going to uh, cut it like that put a point right here I'm going to change the font of this multiple fonts I'm going to ungroup this and then multiple fonts I'm going to select the multiple fonts where's the multiple fonts let's see here I think here we have these it doesn't matter or for the fonts used but it has to be uh, good now I'm going to put the text more smaller like that then I'm going simply to add another text box put here the uh, hanging indent put it the size 24 put it as grass then as bold and here we have the alignment as you can see this is it and that was very easy and simple to do this is the hanging indent that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching and hope to see you soon on the next one